Hey everyone, Manchuk here, and today I'm making a video on a recent update, the Bizarre Skyblock Update 0.7.7. .7. This just released recently, and I'm going to go through everything that's new in the update. I'll get to the Bizarre at the end, I want to talk about the little updates first about it. There was two portals added, there's one here at the Old Shaman, so there's a portal right here, I broke through the wall here. Well, it's, it's, like, it's still there, it's just I can't, it looks invisible. But there's a portal right behind there, I got inside by going up through the bottom of the map. It's hard to glitch in through the wall here. Uh, if you go through it, nothing really happens. There's another portal like this in the Mushroom Desert. We don't know what these portals do. In the Mushroom Desert, I heard it was it's not Abyss and it's not Dungeons. It's some idea that like NPC, the, the HPC or like staff had coming later this year. So this is new here. So this is like a new island. I don't know what it's for though, but it's something no one knows about. But the staff know about it, and I'm pretty sure Deuce has made a tweet of it so i'm pretty sure he's been building he's a build team he's been building this island so we'll see what this is later this year the other new things there are two health changes in the hub i'm gonna go to a mini just so we can chill in there so the redstone house here got changed it looks updated we have this here and then the bee house has this little outside area which is also really really nice so this all got changed and then the bat phone cooldown now is 20 seconds, so the bat phone is a lot faster, 20 seconds cooldown instead of a minute, meaning you can do revs a lot faster, it like doubles the speed of revs if you're completing the kills in 30 seconds, so that's really, really nice. NPCs have now been capped, you can only buy 640 of an item a day. So if I go here and try to buy jungle wood, I can get 10 stacks, and it says you can only buy 640 of this item a day, so that's now capped. And this has made way for the new changes to the bazaar. Quickly before I get to the bazaar, there's also three new fairy souls. If you go to Time Dio's channel, he made a video on it, and there's three new fairy souls in the hub, that's it, just little cool areas where you can get fairy souls. But now I'm gonna talk about and explain Warren and the bazaar. Warren here is discontinued now, it isn't selling any stonks. They were selling stonks of, st stocks of stonks? I forget exactly what it's called, it's right here. Stock of stonks. And these, you could just buy like 640, 10 stacks from him. And then it's kind of like, this is like a stock market. So that was just a test item. You can, they might get removed from the game. We don't know yet, but that's what Warren is for. And later on, you'll be able to sell them to him. But I'm going to explain this whole thing. So this is like a shop for like co commodities. So like materials, like potato pumpkins. We have the combat materials, mining materials, fishing materials, and then wood. And then we also have like red flesh, tarantula, wolf teeth, compactors, hot potato books, summoning eyes, stock, stock of stonks gifts and candies so that's what you can buy here it's like it's not like the auction house auction house is like bidding so you bid it over people this is like buying and selling so it's exactly how stock market works kind of you want to buy stuff cheap and sell it higher so what was happening with these stock of stocks i'll go through and try to explain everything it's pretty complicated but once you know and learn you get a handle of it the stock item here in the middle is just the item that you're looking at it might do anything it might be worth more it just depends what's happening so it's like a test item so you can sell them instantly. Say I had a bunch, I could sell them instantly, or I could buy them instantly. Right now to buy them, it's 12,000 per unit. So one of these costs 12,000 coins. And you can also buy a stack. You can also put in how many you want, or you could fill your inventory. I right there, I just bought one of these. People had like stacks of them, and they would sell them at certain times. So if I sell instantly, it sells. So it sells everything I have. So it sold my inventory of it. You can also create buy orders and sell orders. So if I create a buy order, I can go here and set custom out, or say I want a stack of these, I can do top order plus one. So we see here, the top order is 11,728 coins. And this guy wanted each. So that's how much they're paying for each one. And they're paying 469 times. So that's how many of them they want. And they made two orders of it. So whoever has the highest bid here, gets that first. So when people sell these, whoever is selling the stock of stocks, the same goes for everything else, say summoning eyes. We'll take a look at summoning eyes just because it'll probably be a bit easier to understand. So say I want to stack, if I bid 579,000, I'll be the first person to get my bids filled. So that everyone that's selling them, or who does the sell instantly, or sells an offer, I get the items first. So if you bid the highest, you get them first, and the price will slowly like, decrease. And once one order is filled out, it goes on to the next. I'm trying to explain my best. There probably be a lot of questions in the, the bottom in the description, but 
ask anything you need and uh, like I'll try to answer it. You have to play around with it and like try to figure it out yourself also. So I'll try to keep explaining what's happening. So say I want some summoning eyes and I want to buy a stack. I can buy instantly. So say I want to buy a stack instantly or I could fill my inventory. There's a price here. So if I want one, it's 621,000 coins. But if I want a certain price, so this is what these two options are for. If you want to sell at a certain price or buy at a certain price. So if I sell them at 610k, if the price of people buying them or someone wants to buy them at 610k at that price, then mine will get bid on and sold. If you're buying them, usually the cheapest ones get sold first. And if you're selling, if you're buying them, yeah, you'll, you'll if you're buying them, you'll buy the sell, cheapest ones first. And if you're selling, uh, the people who bid the who are buying items for the most will get uh, yours first. So it's hard to explain. I'm trying my best. I'm probably doing a really bad job at it. Hopefully you guys kind of understand it. It's just like a different place to sell and buy items instantly. So if you want to buy like stuff instantly, you can buy like rotten flesh. There's also enchanted stuff. You can enchant blaze rods, just like more items. So you can buy enchant diamond blocks. So if you want to buy lots of them instantly or sell them instantly, that's what these two options are for. And if you want to buy them at like certain prices or sell them at certain prices, I'm just trying to like repeat. So it's kind of, I don't know. There's no really good way. We, I was talking to the guys a lot and there's no good way to explain this update. It's really hard to explain how it really works. I want to show you the other stuff. So if you have an order here, so right now I bid on mutton. So if I go to my mutton area right here, I want mutton. So I want to make some sheep pets. If, as you can see here, the highest order is 5,315. So this guy is getting his order filled out first since it's the highest order. And so when people sell mutton, he gets the stuff first. So I could, I have my stuff here, which I started buying some. So I got some of my order filled out until someone started paying more for it. So now not my full order will not get filled out until his order is complete. So every time someone auctions mutton for, for him, he'll get it first. If I go now, I can claim it. If I want to cancel my order, I can cancel my order and get my other money back. So I can get my four million back that I paid for this. So now I have mutton here. So that's from people selling instantly or selling at a price that I'm paying for. That's what is in your manage orders right there. This is your history here. So if you want to see your history of what I've done and what I've bought, this is your advanced mode. So you can change the mode if you want to see like the, just the buy and sell price. You can also see an advanced mode and it just gives you more like information on everything. If you go into something, there's also graphs. This is a bit confusing, but it gives you a lot of information. So there's graphs here. It'll make more sense over time. So there's like, you can do 31 days, seven days, 24 hours. It'll make more sense over time. It's also a bit buggy since the server like crashed a bunch. So like they turned off the, uh, the minion or the NPC for a little bit, but there's also graphs. So you can instant sell volume, instant sell moving coins, and instant buy moving coins and sent by volume, you can just see all these different graphs and information about it. That's good to know. I think that's pretty much it. You can also sell your inventory if you want. Be careful because if you click this, it just sells everything instantly. So if you want to sell like instantly, you can also do that. So it's like a different place to sell stuff. Instead of selling items to your merchants now, you can sell them to the bazaar for like more money or less money. It depends like what you auctioning it all at or selling it all at. This is probably a really scuffed video. Um, it's hard, it's really hard to explain. I'm trying to give you guys a good example, but there's not a really great example. It's just like, it's just like a stock market kind of. So like if prices go up and down, like the stock of stonks, that kept going up and down. So when everyone was buying lots of stuff, the prices were like going up. And then when people sold the buy value and then the sell value crashed and just goes up and down and up and down. It's just like want and demand. So it's like, it's hard to explain, but I hope you guys kind of understand it. It's just a good place to buy more things now. And if people use this correctly by flipping items, so like buying stuff cheap and when it goes up. So we'll say when a new update, say with like eggs or something or something and a new update is needed a lot like mutton. So if you can buy that all cheap and then it skyrockets in the update, you can sell it for a lot more money. So people who can figure out the stock market kind of now and who can use this, they can understand it better and use it to make money. So could, this is kind of like a new type of flipping also. But again, if you need anything, if you want to buy something else, say I want to buy five something else for 580k per, 
I can go and buy a thousand summoning eyes or 160 and just instantly buy summoning eyes for like 580k per if I outbid this guy and I'll get summoning eyes. So if I go here, I'm gonna go, I'm not gonna buy a stack, but say I want to outbid this guy, say I want like 10 summoning eyes. I go here, I can do top order. So this will take the top order and add one, or I can also equal the top order, or I can do 5% of the spread. I can read to see what it does there. I can just do top order plus one and buy. So it's six mil and my eyes should start filling up. They get sold pretty fast. But I think you, know, you should make sure because if someone pays more, so right now I have the highest bidding here, 579 and one coin. If someone else bids me, then it'll, it'll cancel me over also. But we should be getting eyes pretty soon. I think someone may have bid over me actually. So I'll here, let me do something. Let me just show you guys. I'll create buy order. We'll do, let's do five. I don't need, I don't need many eyes. I'm going to do five eighty two. Like that. And then that should give me eyes pretty fast. Depending how much you bid, they should be pretty instant. It depends if people sell them. Yeah, see now I already have two to go. So I have two to claim already. My orders, I'm out five. It's 40% filled. And then this guy sold two to the merchant or to the vendor here. So that's just kind of how it works. If I want to buy them instantly, I could buy them instantly at this price. So I could buy a bunch instantly at a certain price or sell them instantly. Or you could, so the sell order is say I want to sell the something guys, I want to sell them at 600K per. So once the bidding people, people setting buy prices goes up to 600K, mine will start getting bid on. And then, then I'll make, get my money from that. So it's, I th hopefully I explained this well enough. Um, it's probably a really bad video, but hopefully you guys kind of understand that now. If I go here, I see 582K, I have all these eyes, I can go claim them. I have five summoning eyes. So doing that, if I want to pay 600K per eye, I could go pay 600K per eye and buy like a thousand eyes instantly and just have summoning eyes for the whole day as people are auctioning eyes. It's like pretty instant. So if you don't have to wait on the auction house, so the auction house, it's like, it's like waiting for bid stand, etc. This is like more like an instant sell and buy. And that wasn't even instant buy. That was me setting a buy order. If I set it really cheap, say like 550K, I'm not going to get my eyes because there's all these other orders that had to happen first. So like these guys are buying hundreds of eyes. You can see the 2X, 57X, 42X, 3X. They were buying tons of eyes. So they'd have to all have their orders cleared out and get their eyes and then it drops to me. But obviously people will make, keep making new buy orders. And so I won't ever get my summoning eyes for that cheap because unless they somehow drop that low. But that's pretty much it. Um, yeah, I just want to try to talk about this update a bit. It's kind of confusing. There's a lot of new stuff here. It's going to be a lot of very confusing for a lot of people. Once you get a handle of it, it's a bit better, but it's just a good place to buy stuff you need. Like there'll be like sugar cane here. You can buy, you can buy stacks of sugar cane. So 106K is the highest bid right there. So yeah, you can buy instantly also for 123K. Hopefully you guys understand this. Sorry if it's a big mess. Um, I tried my best, I guess. Uh, it's really hard. There's no really easy way to like, explain a like, stock market. or It's a really cool, interesting feature. Kind of crazy to think like a Minecraft game has this. If you guys have any questions, for sure, just ask me in the just in the comments. I'll be reading the comments a lot. I'll try to help you guys out. It's probably not a... I don't know. But hopefully it helped you guys out. Just to check, ex, try to explain the update and what's happening a bit more. But just a place to sell your items and sell like commodities and like cheaper items and buy lots of it now. But yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys. Peace.